hurricane season. Three words that put fear into the hearts and minds of every property owner. High winds from storms like this one destroy billions of dollars in residential and business property annually. But now there's a radically new and technologically advanced way to protect residential and business property, the armor screen system. After Hurricane Andrew devastated South Florida in August of 1992, product development began on this revolutionary system. The foundation of Armor Screen Corporation is a combination of a technologically advanced yet economically driven line of proven, superior wind abatement and storm protection products. The premier product that Armor Screen Corporation offers is currently the Armor Screen System. The patented Armor Screen System achieved its Miami-Dade certification in January 2000. Armor Screen is the premier Miami-Dade County approved flexible wind abatement system. Armor Screen not only passed, but actually exceeded the required testing for its Miami-Dade product approval. Impact force five times greater than Miami-Dade. Large missile test without damage. Easily integrated. Freedom of design for architects with strength respected by engineers. Armor Screen benefits include strength, ease of deployment, accessibility, visibility, flexibility, compact storage. The armor screen system is comprised of one of the strongest reinforced geosynthetic polymer materials and a solid stainless steel anchoring system. Armor screen weighs 90% less than most aluminum panels. One person can easily store and deploy an entire house. How technologically advanced is the armor screen system? Consider this. When installed properly, the winds of a 150 mile per hour hurricane would be reduced to a wind force no greater than five miles per hour as it passed through the screen. Additionally, armor screen is 95% solid, preventing the majority of water from entering the protected area. But the most important feature is the armor screen system's ability to prevent debris from entering any armor screen secured area. The engineered installation of the armor screen system is simple and flexible, allowing for customer preferences and complicated applications. What dramatically sets the armor screen system apart from other hurricane protection products is the deflection spacing that is allowed. All other hurricane protection products lay almost flush against the protected opening. Armor screen allows a safe distance between the screen and the opening. The combination of material and installation technique allows both wind and flying debris to decelerate upon impact, dissipating the energy prior to it striking the building. The overall effect? The structure is saved from harm. Armor Screen Corporation is expanding its core operations in Florida, the Caribbean, and all at-risk coastal areas in the United States. Protect your family, home, and business with the most powerful and flexible hurricane protection available on today's market, the Armor Screen System. As residents in the Northeast begin looking at the damage from Hurricane Isabel, we here in South Florida, of course, are breathing a sigh of relief. We know what a storm like this can cause. So today, Channel 10 problem solver Mark Schumacher is checking out a new and unique way to protect your home during a storm. The collection car dealership in Coral Gables houses some pretty pricey merchandise, so you might be surprised to hear that in the event of a hurricane, this building and its contents will be protected by a screen. Absolutely did not believe it in the beginning. It's hard to imagine until you see it in action. This unique hurricane protection is called the armor screen. Armor screen is a high-tech approach to hurricane protection. It's using an extremely tough fabric to do what rigid shutters used to do. It mounts to a house or building using hooks above the windows and doors. The screens are folded up in bags for storage. So how in the world does this stuff work? Well, after they hang it up here, what they have to do is lash it down to a big eye bolt like this. Now, once they do this, this entire screen here really turns into like a trampoline. Just look at this test video. Whenever they fire a two by four at it, boing, it bounces right off. We have impacted it with uh, the 2x4 that D Dade County uses with five times the force that Dade County requires. And at that point, it was simply bouncing back. That's why the armor screen is Miami-Dade County code-approved hurricane protection. Another selling point is the fact that you can see out of the screens after they're put up. 
basically the product sounds like a good product. Uh, it's the screen itself can resist very high wind loads. Structural engineer Irving Absug had never seen the armor screen, so we asked him for an opinion. And I, I like it. I like the product. I, I'm, uh, I will, you know, bring it up to, you know, con architects that I work with. I think it, it has a lot of potential. Armor screens, by the way, are comparable in price to standard shutters, which means they're much cheaper than accordions, roll downs, or those impact resistant windows. The only drawback is your house must have eaves. These screens have to mount away from the windows they are protecting. So if this hurricane season has you thinking about new protection for your house, armor screens should be something you check out as an option because we like what we see. For the Channel 10 Problem Solvers, I'm Mark Schumacher. Getting ready for a new century of storms. And welcome back to the new CBS4 Weather Control. Periodically, new products come along that can make dealing with a hurricane easier. So I thought I'd show you some of the ones that I've come across this year. The first one is a kind of shutter, but it's not really a shutter. It's more a barrier made out of an extremely strong polypropylene screening. It's made for large openings like garage doors, screened in pool areas, or difficult to shutter doorways. You hook it to bolts at the top and the bottom, and the amazing thing is that it actually stops the wind like a dam, and at the same time, you can see through it from the inside. This company's product is Dade County approved, and you can find out more at www.armorscreen.com. Of course, we all hope that we don't have to use it for a hurricane, but as I said, there is nothing to do but to be prepared. Now, here in South Florida, you need code-approved hurricane protection for your home. Usually that means wooden or aluminum shutters. But we found a local company that's developed a new hurricane screen to protect your home. On South Florida's pricey Palm Beach coast sits a nearly complete $10 million mansion. Among the finishing touches, giant screens to cover every exposed area. This isn't protection against bugs or burglars, it's hurricane protection. It's, it's interesting. Um, some people are very skeptical, um, and usually the tests convince them. It's called the armor screen, and it withstood impact tests five times greater than what Dade County code requires. It's the only hurricane protection device to pass the most strenuous wind load tests. Before you're getting up there, five, six, seven hundred, seven hundred, eight hundred, nine hundred. Uh, we've recently tested a 16-foot screen at 276 miles an hour, which is tornado pressures. Pretty amazing for something that weighs less than a pound per square yard. You can fold it up and store it like you would a bed sheet or a drape or anything like that. By virtue of its design, the screen offers a form of protection that shutters and panels cannot. Uh, indications are that we are a dampening force uh, to hold down the roof. While the owners of this home spared no expense in its construction, but the protection they offer may be priceless. Now, many Florida school systems, businesses, hospitals, hotel chains, and even some municipal governments are using the armor screen to protect their buildings. For more information on the armor screen, go to our web channel, clickdent.com. Very interesting. Yeah. And it won't be too long before we have to start worrying about hurricane season. Yeah, huh? I know. Months. It's coming up. By the way, since Hurricane Andrew, a lot of innovative uh, devices have come on the market. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, that one looks like it's, uh, you know, might be uh, kind of promising. Yes. A Windward Elementary School is the first hurricane shelter on Oahu to benefit from new protection technology. This is Armor Screen. Well, it looks like just any other screen. It's uh, strong enough to withstand hurricane force winds and anything else Mother Nature throws at it. It'll catch the rain on this side and sheet it, and the rain will just sheet down and run off. All right. It's been tested to over 270 miles an hour. The screens don't need to be permanent window covers either because they install and remove quickly. The last thing we need is for kids to be vandalizing our hurricane protection, so this is wonderful. Um. <coughs> Oahu Civil Defense hopes to use the product at other shelters on the island. Oahu Civil Defense officials today unveiled a new system to increase hurricane shelter capacity. As KITV 4's Ben Gutierrez reports, it's a lightweight way to protect windows from hurricane debris. Hurricane protection in a bag. That's what civil defense officials showed off today at Kahalu'u Elementary School. It's called the armor screen system. It's made to protect windows from wind debris up to 250 miles an hour. 
It's a polypropylene type material. Uh, it's got a very tight weave, as you can see. It's basically 95% solid. The Civil Defense Agency says it chose the armor screen for several reasons. The lightweight uh, materials, ease of storage, and the ease of deploying the system once we needed to during a hurricane watch or warning. Holes for hooks are covered up in normal weather so they can't be vandalized, but if there's a hurricane watch or warning, the holes are uncovered, hooks are put in, and the screening goes up. It takes about an hour to cover all the windows. The armor screening is lightweight and easy to put up, but just how strong is it? Well, Civil Defense asked us to put it to the wood. A 4x4 four four to be exact. The $18,000 project was funded by a grant from the Project Impact Federal Program. Kahalu'u Elementary was picked because of a shortage of hurricane shelter space in the area. And so this was a perfect opportunity to increase the shelter space for, you know, people on the east shore that, um, well, all the way from here to Kahuku. Civil Defense says having the armor screening will allow this room to hold another 350 people during a hurricane. The screening also gets a thumbs up from the Kahalu'u Elementary Principal. In Kahalu'u, Ben Gutierrez, KITB4 News. Being joined by Bill Winter, and he's going to be the demo guy for our armor screen, latest and greatest in window covering. I'm going to stand behind here, and he guarantees me with this little high-pressure gun that he's got that I'm not going to get wet because he says armor screen is windproof and rainproof. That's right. You might get a little bit, when I get close, you might get a little bit of water through it, but this product not only stops the wind, the rain, it also stops the flying debris, and like I said, you can see through it, easy to deploy, it's the latest and the greatest. All right, let's get this underway. I'm going to step behind here. The beauty of the armor screen is that you can put it up and you can actually see through this stuff. Here he goes now, and yes, I am actually staying dry which is pretty good news. <laughs> Actually, there's a little bit of water coming through here, but overall, it's really not that bad considering the fact that he's got a high pressure wash pointed at this. It's really some pretty impressive stuff. You can check it out.